Nicola. And this is Bossa Nova Life. Bringing you Atomic Era events, people, and places. From classic cars to vintage tiki bars. And today we're in... McMinnville, Oregon for Cruising McMinnville. That's right, baby. Cars, cars, cars. How are you doing today? I'm good, man. How are you? Doing well. And what is your name? Devin Morley. Devin, and where are you from? Here in McMinnville, Oregon. Well, we're right here from yeah. town. I love yes, it. Yes, sir. And what have we got here, man? Uh, right here, we got my 63 Fairlane Ranch Wagon. I love it. A nice yeah. long roof. Long and, uh, roof, buddy. And you went and got the, the bikes to go yep. with it and everything. Yep. So did you get it in this condition? Uh, well, we got it in a non-running and driving condition. Okay. Um, so I went through, it's got the original 260 in it. Nice. Uh, so we kind of hopped it up, put a little bigger cam in there. Okay. Um, rid it all suspension front and back, uh, all new interior. Uh, we ended up having to buy this because I had a kid, so, you know. <laughs> Figured uh, I gotta get rid of the two-door hot rod, gotta sell some family wagon. Well, it looks like you got the original paint, but you may put a little pinstriping on it. Oh yeah, original paint, had uh, my buddy Monk stripe it up, okay. stripes all my stuff. So nice. even my bikes, he's done line work on those. I so. love that, I yeah. love it. So you're saying you're driving the whole family around in it? Yes sir. This is the best yeah. part of the story yet. Right? This is this is warming Lola's heart. So much better than getting a minivan. <laughs> you can oh, drive right? around in style. It's can't slight, have a minivan. slightly sexier than a minivan. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right, so what are you getting, like eight miles a gallon on this bad boy? Uh, what's some smiles per gallon, man? Who's <laughs> keeping track? I don't keep track. It's got a full tank of gas, we go. <laughs> is, it, is it yours? <laughs> oh. Yeah. It, it will be one day, one way or the other. Oh, yeah. She already claims it. Where are you from, Doug? I'm McMinnville. McMinnville, mm -hmm. right here in town. I love it. You're the second McMinnville guy I've run in today. Good. Uh, so what have we got here? We got a 1965 Thunderbird. I love it. I bought this back in 86, right out of high school. Okay, I like that even more. Yeah, so we just did a ground up restoration on it. So you've had it for about years 35 ago. years? Yeah. Something like that, okay. Yeah, it's been my baby all that time. So you're the one who picked out this awesome paint job. Yes, it's actually a Cadillac color that we just added some red to. Yeah, just Lola noticed it all the way down the street. She's like, I love the oh, color of that nice. T-Bird. Yeah. So what are you running in it? It's a 390. 390, it's okay. It's original. I love it. Yeah, so nothing's really been changed on it except for the paint. <laughs> Did you do any uh, underbody work at all, brakes? Uh, no, actually, we're looking at this, the actual original tires. We're looking at because it's got 70,000 original miles on it. Wow, so, yeah, amazing. So. so you get to drive it around much? I do. I That's do. what we, we like to hear. We drive it. Uh, parents live out in Oregon City, so we do kind of back and forth. My father and I, I grew up with my father doing restorations on cars for a hobby. So So do you guys do the interior yourself? Yes. Actually, we. this is the color of the interior was. Yeah. A red, the same color, but we added a little flake to it so that you yeah. get a little bit, a little bit more sparkle to it. But it's basically the same color that came with it. The car originally was black. We changed it to this color here, yeah, just to brighten it. it up a little bit. And this is your fa a family car, right? You're with your family today. Yes, family's back. Take them around, driving through the. See the son with the black hat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah the one with the black hat over there. So yeah, we. Uh, it's, it's garage most of the time, so we just uh, take it out once in a while. But we had the pandemic last year, so we yeah, didn't yeah. have it out last year yes. much at all. But <laughs> yeah, so we're, it's kind of its maiden voyage this year for some shows. So. <laughs> well, I love it. Thanks so yeah. much. Yeah, definitely. Thanks for giving Thank us you. Time. Oh, no, Lola. What's your favorite kind of pupper? Uh, I like all dogs. <laughs> but this is so she good. says. Yeah. Yes. Her name's Holly. Holly. Oh, Holly. Ma'am. Very cute. Hey, you two. Hey, how's it going? Hey, you two. My wife has to say that she loves the colors of your ride. Did you guys pick this out yourself? <laughs> it was an he accident. Did. I love no, it, man. He did. It's pretty.
Nate Snell. We're from Portland, Oregon. Wonderful. And what have we got here? We got a 1963 Chevy Nova convertible. I yeah, I don't see too many of these around. No, I don't think they even have one Nova at all at this entire car well, show. Well, usually you see the 70s Novas for sure, right. but the yeah, early 60s right. ones not so much. So where did you uh, get it? You know, we got this. This was a COVID buy down in Arizona. Oh, wow. My wife and I drove it all the way back up. Yeah, well, that's a good trip. Yeah, it was great. And it made it. And it totally made it, <laughs> yep. Was it in the shape when you got it? It was, yep. Amazing. Yep. So uh, what do you know about it? So it was a two-owner car, bought in Washington, and okay. put heated seats in it because it was so cold. And, and you brought it back to the PNW. Yeah, like and we that. decided, you know, they took it, the second owner's uh, retired folks trailered it behind an RV, took it down to Arizona, towed it around, and then we rescued it and brought it back up to the That's Northwest. That's right. It was a rescue. That's what you tell your wife. Like, baby, I'm rescuing it. It's a it. rescue car. That's it's right. like a, a rescue, rescue dog. You're like, you look, know? I, I, am, I am a giving person. We right? have to do this. Yes, yeah, you have to. <laughs> I love it. So what's it running in it? It's got a 350 crate. Uh, it's okay. got a TH350 turbo hydromatic transmission. Well, it's reliable. It gets up and goes. That's right. That's how, that's how we got back so well. That's right. I love it. Thank well, you. thanks, man. I appreciate your time. Absolutely. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Are you guys having a good time at the cruise? Oh, man. Great having time. Having fun. Yeah, Cobra. Hi, Boston Nova. Having a good time at the cruise? Having a fantastic time, Boston Nova. <laughs> to see this but this sparkly is amazing They're, they're lining them up today, and this is like one of the newest gassers I think I've ever actually seen. I didn't know I found them, but I did. My name's John Mermis. Where are you from, John? Eugene, Oregon. Eugene. Well, I'm from Eugene. There you go. Perfect place to be. Yeah. So what have we got here, man? It's a 1946 Chevrolet Suburban. I love it. Did you get it in this condition? No, it was uh, mostly this far along. It was originally purchased by the Portland Electric Company. They okay. Were in trolleys. This was a crummy that hauled guys up and serviced trolley <laughs> wow. electronics. Uh huh. Uh, they had it for several decades, and then the general manager purchased it, started the restoration, and uh, fell short, uh, died of cancer. Oh wow. And then I bought it through the estate. So how long have you had it? About nine years. Nine years, okay. Did, you, did it already have the paint on it and the interior, or what did you do? No, I've done all the interior, I've done the wood floor, uh, done some motor and transmission changes, okay. airbagged it, did all the suspension. I, I, like it's, I like the stance on it for sure. So what's it running? Uh, 235 inline six. So the original? No, the originals were a 216, but 216, they were a okay. bearing motor, and right. they, uh, they weren't very reliable. So yeah, the common okay. swap was a 235. All right, but similar horsepower, I would yeah, think. Similar yeah, similar okay. platform. Yeah, I like it. I like Single it. Single barrel carburetor. <laughs> Gets good grape. Well, this thing's amazing. Mine. I don't know how I haven't seen it puttering around town. Mostly keep in the garage. It's tough to drive it around and fear that somebody's going to smash into a quarter panel you can't find anymore. Yeah, this is a rare ride. I didn't. I, I go to a cluster car shows all the time and I have not seen one of these before. There's about seven of them yeah. painted running and driving around in the U.S. Oh wow, just seven. Yeah. Amazing. Thanks, man. You bet. You thought I was trouble. Uh, this is trouble. double the trouble. 